morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to the theater. It is Thursday today, <laughs> and I'm already falling into the old pitfalls of I haven't edited the vlog from yesterday. Good job, me. Anyways, I am here. I'm a little tired. I woke up at like 20 to 6. <laughs> And I don't really think I got back to sleep after that. I was like, listen, body, like, you don't have to pee. You're comfortable. You're warm. It's dark in the room. You don't have to wake up for like another hour and a bit. Go back to sleep. And it was like, nah. <laughs> so that's where we're at. I'm pretty awake now. <laughs> but I could have slept longer. That's like the sad part. Like I could have slept for closer to six hours and I slept for like five and a little bit. But what can you do? Today should be a four hour shift. We have a show tonight though, so that's like super exciting. 50 people! <laughs> and then um, after work, I think my mom and I are gonna do some running around to get some groceries for the next couple nights of dinners. We're trying to go back to meal planning, which is awesome, except we're like still in the like, not quite doing it properly, but we're doing it again, so that's great because I'm like, mother. We are not going to the grocery store every single day to get groceries, no. So that's good. Now it's like every like four to five days, which is better, but I prefer it if it was every like two weeks. Like we were so good at the start of this anyways. Um, and then I actually want to go to Walmart, which is open again after it caught fire and burnt a little bit, um, <laughs> to pick up a shoe rack because I ordered a shoe rack from Amazon because Walmart burnt a little bit <laughs> and then they couldn't deliver the one from Amazon because it got damaged in delivery so I'm getting a refund and I'm like if I order this again one I cannot ensure that it's going to get to me without getting destroyed again and two I'm gonna have to wait an entire month to get it because I guess they're out of stock so fingers crossed they have it in stock at Walmart because from what I heard they have been slowly bringing in stock, obviously, because they would have had to replace every single thing in that store because of smoke damage. Don't people suck? And like, from what I understand, is somebody caught toilet paper on fire, so then they could go steal stuff from the electronic section, and then they got caught. Maybe not at the time, but they got caught. So like, what was the point? <laughs> Anyways, steal better and don't burn things down. <laughs> So that's the plan for after work. And then when I get home, I think it's scrunchy ironing time. I got probably just under half ironed yesterday. So that was exciting. But now I have five more patterns of like big batches. So we'll see. Anyways, I'm rambling now. I'm gonna go have my breakfast drink and I will catch you on the flip side. Well, hello. <laughs> it has been so long. I am home now, it's 1.30 actually, it's not as late as I thought it was. I got off work at noon and then my mom and I did some running around, ate some food and then I just laid in my bed for a while because I was just like totally unmotivated. Like I took off my work clothes <laughs> and I was like bra and underwear. I got a new sports bra today, it's very exciting. Hoo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> Basically I struggle with finding a bra because I got the big chest anyways. <laughs> I got other exciting things today too. So I love booty slippers and um, I've been trying to replace mine for a while. I'm not sure where mine are in this disaster. Probably under here somewhere. There they are. Anyways, I've been trying to replace them and I've been looking for like probably a year and a half and I finally found some. I'm so excited about them. Also, key is the rubber sole. Oops, things are falling. Okay, I'm gonna put those on in a minute. <laughs> I got some dry shampoo. I normally don't use dry shampoo or anything because I am super sensitive to aerosols, but I'm hoping that this one being unscented and I've used Dove before and had luck <laughs> will make a difference. Um, I mostly got it because I've been going on walking so much lately that my hair's been getting gross faster. Also, if we're being honest, I push when I should shower like a little bit later at, all the time. Anyways, continuing. I got uh, three of these totes here. Uh, for storage purposes because uh, I should be able to fit one on top of that one and then two here so I can get those guys at least out of Ziploc bags and into these so that's exciting. I also picked up uh, some labels for when I'm mailing stuff that are just a little bit bigger than the ones I have. The ones I have I feel are just a little bit too small to comfortably write on. And then lastly <laughs> I got 
this shoe rack, which I talked about. I ordered one on Amazon and um, it never appeared because it, it broke on the way. <laughs> so I got this one at Walmart. It was a little bit cheaper too, which was nice. And also I didn't have to wait a month to get another one off Amazon. So those are all very exciting things. I feel like really organized and put together now. <laughs> well, no, that is like, I feel like I'm on the way because if you look around my room and let me just get back here so you can see, like it's just a complete, those clothes still have not got put away, an utter disaster. Behind here, I've got like two garbage bags cause I'm just that lazy. Um, and then you turn the corner and it's just, it's bad. I was gonna make my bed before I start filming this, but I just want you to see how bad it's bad. It real bad. <laughs> so as much as I do want to relocate the Christmas scrunchies <laughs> and finish ironing them, like I did, I did a fair amount yesterday. I've got this entire tray is done and ready to go, but I think that's only like a third of what I have. So anyways, as much as I want to get onto that, I'm gonna take some time to do things like make my bed and organize these and build that and put those clothes away, maybe even do my laundry, I don't know. So that's where we're at, I'm gonna start picking up, but first I'm very excitedly going to put on these slippers and then I'm gonna throw up my old slippers because they are long gone. I still need to replace this pair because <laughs> they're just slip-on ones. So yes, I do have two different types of slippers because I like the booty ones to be nice and warm, but like in the middle of the night, if I'm getting up to go to the bathroom or something, I want ones that I can just slip into. Could I just not wear slippers? Absolutely. But do I wanna wear slippers? I do. Anyways, I'm gonna go now because I rambled enough and I'm not really sure where to start, but we're gonna start. love that this is here now because now I have somewhere to put my camera that's not either too low or too high. Anyways, it has been some time. It is currently 3.30. I've done most of the organization. I have not folded my clothes. That's probably next on the list. I just took a pause um, to like, do nothing. I also realized because I was washing two masks, one that I made at the beginning of my new template and one that I made more recently and they're significantly different in size and I was like, oh my god. <laughs> and I guess just from like cutting the masks and constantly missing and cutting the template, I've shaved off I would say probably a quarter of an inch which is fine for me because it fits my face great still but I recently noticed that my mom's boyfriend's mask looked way too small and I was like, that's really weird and then today I was like, oh, it's gone significantly smaller. So I reached out to one of my friends and I was like, hey, is your mask significantly smaller than like the template that I sent? Uh, Cause if so, I will make you some new ones and send them to you free of charge. And she's like, yeah, I thought I was going crazy. I'm like, nope. <laughs> so yeah, so that's another two masks to add to my master plan for next week. I like don't even want to get started on it. Cause that's now, 13 masks plus my mom's boyfriend wants me to make a couple more which I was going to anyways but now that I'm realizing like how different of a size they are I definitely gonna anyway I feel like I've been getting a lot done which is fantastic I'm gonna fold the clothes now I think I still need I've got these two pictures uh, that I still need to put up oh geez calm down that's heavy um I'm just not sure where <sighs> 
Like if I want to put them up here, I pretty much have to rearrange the entire gallery wall. Like I think I could get the twin of that one up top there, but I don't think I can get the twin of the pink one. Maybe I can get one there or something. We'll see. I do want to get more hoops up on that wall eventually, but in order to do that, I have to like embroider more. <laughs> it's basically where we're at. But yeah, I think the plan could be, don't hold me to this, <laughs> but the plan could be fold my clothes, don't put them away because ugh. <laughs> it'll be the second time I fold it somebody's clothes and then maybe take out my garbage and my recycling and all that and then maybe go for a walk because it is currently, like I said, 3.30. 5, 3 30 um, and it's 12 degrees outside which is nice it's also supposed to pour rain this weekend so uh, I kind of want to like get some walks in so yeah those are the thoughts I'm having we'll see if I follow through <laughs> bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit to I decided to go for a walk instead of doing any of the other things because I'm the absolute worst. But I'm home now, so that's super exciting. Um, I just tried the dry shampoo and two problems with it. One, I don't brush my hair, which is like a thing that you're supposed to do. Didn't think that one through because um, of the waves and stuff. I, d I don't brush it, I just finger brush it in the shower with conditioner in it. And number two, it's not scented, but the aerosol still does not get along well with my lungs, but that's fine. We'll figure it out. Any or just not use it. Anyways, I did almost 5K. <laughs> it was like 4.75, I think. And um, feeling quite warm. Feeling great, but feeling quite warm. We got a mane going on here, so I'm going to pull that back up here in a second. Probably change out of this outfit because... While it was very windy out there, I think there's like a storm coming in tonight, um, I'm very warm. So that's what I'm going to do. And then I should probably take the time to fold the clothes again, like I said, for some of them. And um, kind of get my ducks in a row for the rest of today, because I do have to remember to do invoicing at some point, as well as I'm sure other things. So that's where we're at. And at some point, I really should start ironing those scrunchies again, which I'm like, la la la, they don't exist because there's still so many. Did I, where did I put the bin? Oh yeah, it's right here. So yeah, there's, I would say there's about 20 to 24 of those five colors. It'll be fine, it'll be fine. I won't be fine though, I need to get out of this outfit. Hello, it's me again. It has been some time. <laughs> so basically last I picked up the camera, I think I said I was going to get out of my gross sweaty clothes because I was gross and sweaty. And then I was like, wait, I'm gonna shower, but I'm gonna have dinner first. So I ate, showered, this is where we are. I ironed another 60-ish scrunchie, so that's great. I have about another 40 to go, but it is like 10 to 9, so I'm going to take a pause from the cause, and I'm quickly going to do the invoicing. I say quickly, but I don't think it's going to be quickly. Um, I figure it'll probably be about an hour, so I'm going to do that now, and then the goal is to, when I'm done that, finish ironing because that would be great. I burnt my thumb a little bit because I <laughs> used my metal ruler to go on the inside because it's pretty much the same size as the scrunchies so I can get nice and flat um, but pulling it out when it's hot I burnt my thumb a little bit. It'll be fine I'm sure. But yeah so I'm gonna do this and then I don't have too much more to do on my list after I do invoicing so that's exciting. My recycling went out. My garbage did not but that could happen another day and I think I'm gonna end up doing laundry tomorrow so like my I might as well just leave those clothes until tomorrow when I do laundry and do them all together. <laughs> How many times have I said that? Anyways, I'm gonna get to work and I will see you in a little bit. Mm -hmm. 
Well, that took a lot longer than expected. <laughs> and there were so many things where I was like YOLOing it. I was like, well, this makes the most sense to me. Or I was like, I don't know where this place is exactly. I'm just gonna guess. And so like my email to my boss was like, you should probably check this. Also, this didn't make sense to me. So this is how I interpreted it. Oh, right. Crap, there was another one that I wasn't sure of. <laughs> um, da -da -da -da. Yeah, there's just like some things where it's like, <laughs> you just kind of interpret something as is and then kind of hope for the best. There it is. <laughs> okay, now we're good. <laughs> Officially good. I thought there was one other one. Yeah, so there's a lot of like really random things. That I was just like, I don't know, but this is my best guess. And then there was one where I was like, I have just no idea where this place is. And I asked my boss before, I was like, can you tell me where this place is? And um, he's like, oh, I did the invoice. And I'm like, bro, that doesn't help either of us because then I can't help you. That is way too close. Uh, then I can't help you. So I reached out to Strudel's mom and I was like, yo, can you tell me where this place is? Because I don't know where it is. But yeah, so... I, it's like 20 after 10 now and like part of me is like you should keep ironing and the other part of me is like maybe you should like climb into bed and read. Novel thought. So I'm just going to wander about for a bit and think about what I want to do. And then like the other rational part of me is like, hey, edit vlogs before you fall behind again. And I'm like, Psh, whatever. Anyways, I'm going to go for now and I will check in with you once I decide what I'm doing. <laughs> so I made the decision to climb into bed, get a snack and watch a movie and let me tell you the last half hour has just not been it for me it's just been like a disaster of moving things so like clothes off the bed I know I know <laughs> but then I'm putting my ironing board back up on the desk but then in order to do that I had to move some stuff that's on the desk and it's just ah uh, so it's basically 11 now and then Strudel's mom messaged me back and was like oh here's where this place is I was like okay cool I won't worry about it and I was like no I'll do it so then I did it um but yeah so I am now in my jammies all the way I mean I've been in my jammies but I took off the bra so like we are ready to cuddle up under this weighted blanket um I do enjoy this weighted blanket still not entirely sure if it's making a difference but He's nice and cozy and I like it. I had to re-tie the bottom ties though today. Like everything, as I mentioned, when I flip, when I switch the cover, like it's all zipped around here and tied, but the bottom is just tied because that's where it goes in. And so I guess it untied and then it was making things weird. Anyways, we're good now. I think I'm going to find something to put on and then try to get to sleep before 1 a.m. today. That'd be great. But the problem is, because I haven't been sleeping a lot, so even when I do wake up or get to sleep early, then I wake up after like five hours. So fingers crossed it gets better. And um, with that, I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> good night.